It's the start of a new vlog. I hope y'all enjoy. <laughs> What is this? Oh, I ordered some stuff from Amazon that I'm gonna show y'all really quick. So I got some like resistance bands. They're different um, like intensities, I guess. This is light. I just dropped the medium one. This is heavy and then this is extra heavy. So got those. Got some 10 pound dumbbell weights. I got my favorite um, lip gloss. I got a headband. It says headband for men. I mean, I don't know why that matters, but yeah. I got like like some sweat headbands. Ow. <laughs> like some sweat bands. And then here are my lashes. I got another box with some other stuff in it. Like I said, I got two dumbbells, two 10 pound dumbbell weights, which was so hard to carry upstairs. So heavy. And then I have another box right here. I don't know what's in it but it ain't nothing that i need right now and i don't need to open it so i'm not gonna i'll open it when i get back so i did open my other package i went one up with y'all this morning had my sweatbands um or the little headbands hold up let me open this because i didn't fully open this one but i showed y'all my resistance bands and the lashes because i put the lashes on this morning just some little like headbands but they're for working out sports headbands so i'm assuming that they're supposed to really like catch the sweat because i have other headbands but they're more like these ones seem more like sweat proof kind of i don't know but yeah i think it's like four or five of them in here just did a little arm workout no weights or nothing because i told you i did buy some 10 pound weights but the 10 pound weights might be too much for like what i want to do with my arms i just want to tone my arms i don't want to like you know what I'm saying? So the 10 pounds might be too heavy for, no, I mean, 10 pounds would be okay for certain stuff, I think. But I just did a weightless arm workout just now. I'll link the girl below that I'll be watching like her stretching videos, cardio workout videos, the arm uh, thing, whatever workout that I just watched. It was only like six minutes, but it was hard. It was a six minute long video, but the workout itself was like five minutes and you're supposed to try not to drop your arms the whole time like in between exercises you're supposed to keep your arms up like not drop them and it was hard i dropped my arms a little over halfway through so i almost i almost did it i almost did it i think if i do it a couple more times like be consistent with it i can definitely get through the whole thing the whole five minutes without dropping my arms but it started to burn over your shoulders bro like i needed a break but yeah so i did that just a little quick little arm workout. I don't know. I just wanted to do it real quick. So did that. That was my first workout in like like two weeks, maybe a week and a half. I haven't I haven't been on a run in like two weeks, and I haven't done either like any of my in home workouts. I did a stretching exercise the other day, but it wasn't like a workout. It was just stretching. So yeah, that was my first like workout in a couple of weeks. So yeah, I feel good. I also got this. I've been looking at this a lot on Amazon recently. They actually sell this in Walmart, but I got it on Amazon. And this is the Guru Nanada. I guess that's how you say it. That's the brand, Guru Nanada. This is oil pulling, or it's an it's a oil rinse. Oil pulling oral rinse. <laughs> Says it right there. So you swish this in your mouth, kind of like mouthwash. You don't swallow it, obviously. I mean, you don't swallow mouthwash either. Um, this is the coconut and mint. I guess they have different, different ones, but it's to help like freshen your bread, helps with like cavity prevention, or it's supposed to. I don't really know for real, but I just be seeing, I've seen, I can't remember. I think I've seen somebody on YouTube talking about oil pulling one time. And then I kind of like started looking into it more and I was like, hmm, maybe that, you know, to help just like your overall oral health. So yeah, it also comes with a cute little toothbrush and a case. So I probably start using this as a, it's so weird. The bristles are so wide, but I probably keep this as like a travel toothbrush because I use an electric toothbrush, but yeah. So this is the bottle. This was like $13 maybe. This is, it also helps with like naturally whitening your teeth. Um, what else does it say? It says some other stuff on here. And I also got two books. 
I know that I was reading the series. The first one that I read was We'll Always Have Summer, which is actually the last book in the series. So I didn't finish that one once I realized it was a series. So then I went ahead and I bought The Summer I Turned Pretty, which is the first one. And then this is the second one. So I just finished the first one like two nights ago. And then this is the second one in the series. This is It's Not Summer Without You. And then I'm gonna go back and finish like the last maybe two chapters, two or three chapters. So these are all three books. So cute, they're really cute books. Um, but like I said, this is the one that I just got and this is the first, no, I'm lying, what? This is the one I finished, I just finished. This is the first book in the series, just finished that one. This is the one that I just got, this is the second one, so I'm gonna start that probably tonight. Um, and then this is the first book that I bought from the series but this is the last one in the series. Then the other book that I got, this is called Wake by Amanda Hawking. It has a sticker over it, but I'm pretty sure her name is Amanda. Yeah, Amanda Hawking. This is also a series, so this I think is the first book. Then they also have Lullaby and Tidal, but I wanna say it's like four or five books in this series. I think it's more than three. Now, the thing about this is, I already read this book, but I read it years and years and years ago, but I didn't know that it was a series back then because I had got it out the library. So I didn't, I don't think I realized that this was a series until like a little while later, but then I just never went back to read the other ones. So because it's been so long, I'm gonna reread this one. And then when I'm finished, I'm gonna get the other books in the series so we can finish it, okay? But this one is like about sirens or mermaids. Um, from what I can remember. I definitely read this. Me and my mom both read this and we really liked it. But yeah, so I got both of these on Amazon. I will link them below. This was really good from what I can remember. But like I said, I read this like years ago. We're gonna reread it and then I'll let y'all know what I like about it or you know, if I like it. Uh, so we're keeping on track. I said I was trying to read like one book a month. So we, we pretty on track with it. But yeah, that's all I want to show y'all. It is now 6.30 on the diet. Well, 6.29. So not 6.30 on the diet. But I'm about to eat and get ready for bed. And like I said, I will catch y'all tomorrow. But I just wanted to show y'all the stuff that I got. My books and everything. Because I'm very excited about them. Hey, you guys. So it is, it's been a minute since I talked to y'all last. I think the last time I talked to y'all was Sunday. It's Wednesday, the 24th, April 24th. And I'm about to go to Ulta really quick. It's 6.42. I should have went way earlier, like when I got off at 5 o'clock. But I forgot that I needed to get a moisturizer. I'm running out of my Neutrogena Hydro Boost. So I'm going to get another moisturizer. I want to try the Bioma Cream, like moisturizing cream. Hold up, let me see what it's called. Bioma Moisturizing Gel Cream. So I'm going to go to Ulta and get that. Last time I looked online, it said that they were having a, um, a sale like on that particular product. It was like a couple dollars off. So I was like, yeah. Why not get a couple dollars off while I can? I think the sale ends on March 1st. I mean, May 1st. So I know I have y'all at a horrible angle, but um, it's the next day. It's not the same day. I know I look like I'm wearing the same thing I was wearing yesterday. I'm not. I mean, I am, but I'm not. I'm just wearing the jacket. I don't have the whole little film that I had on yesterday. Like my whole, the little blue, like jumpsuit thing that goes with this. I just have the jacket on today and I have on some jeans that I wore to work. So yeah, I need to go to Target. I have this bump right here. Ow, it hurts. Like it really hurts. Um, Victoria's Secret Bare Vanilla. One of my favorite little body mists. And this is the Sol de Janeiro 71. Another one of my favorite body mists. I'm gonna wash this section of my hair before <coughs> shit. Before um tomorrow, or I'm gonna do it tomorrow wash this side of my hair because I am going to Maryland for my friend Angeline's birthday. Her birthday is today. She turned 25 and she's having a, 
a little birthday party for her um for her birthday this weekend so yeah and we're staying at well me um Shade and Raven are staying at Diera's new apartment um which we haven't been yet so this will be I think all of our first time going to her new apartment she just moved a couple of months ago so yeah that'll be fun so we're gonna go tomorrow Raven is gonna come Saturday because she has to work tomorrow um but me and Sade are going tomorrow. I get off at 5, so then I'm going to go up to Maryland. When I get off, like, I'll have everything packed so I can be ready to go as soon as I get off. And then Sade lives in Philly, so she'll be there. Um, she's supposed to be coming tomorrow, too, to Deer's. So, yeah, I need to get um, Deer, like, a housewarming gift. I already got her, I like, this little basket. I got it from, like, Family Dollar. I think it was, like, $5. I got a little basket, like a little woven kind of basket, and I got, her favorite color is green, so I got her this green cup, just like a regular little, um, like plastic or glass, it might be a glass cup, I think it's actually glass, but, um, it has like a straw with a wooden top, and it's green, it's so cute, um, and then I also got her a, like, margarita shaker, like a mixed drink maker type of thing, you know, the little shaker thing, that, uh, which I actually got one for me and my mom too, or my mom actually got it. Um, for me and her too like at home so yeah I don't have it with me here because it's for my parents house so, like whenever I come down me and my mom like to make drinks and stuff so we got that we had one before but anyway so we got that it's really cute and it's green like I said Dior's favorite color is green so I was just trying to do you know something like that and I probably would get her like a little gift card to Target um because I don't think she's like finished decorating her house and everything or her apartment so I'll get her a little gift card to Target and then I want to get like one or two other things to put in the little basket. Just like some like little stuff for her. Um, I guess I could get a bottle of wine too. I don't know how much she actually really drinks wine like that. So I don't know. But yeah, I might just get a little bottle of wine just to put in there. You know. Um, and then I think I'm going to get some shot glasses too. This little piece. I don't know what it's doing, but I think I'm going to get some shot glasses, too. I don't know if she already has shot glasses for her apartment, but, yeah. I figured I can just get her a little set, just, like, four shot glasses. Um, so, like, when she has a bunch of people over, she has shot glasses. What I'm about to do, and I'm not going to have time to do it tomorrow, because, like I said, I'm going to be, like, getting, like, heading up to Maryland as soon as I get off tomorrow at 5 o'clock. I don't want to have to, like, stop and get a bunch of stuff i already got a bottle for angelina for her birthday i just need to get a bow to put on it i don't know if i'm gonna get a bag because the bottle was heavy and it's not gonna it'll probably just rip through the bag or like you know the handles will pop off so i think i'm just gonna get a bow to put on the bottle and then i'll get a card and write something in it for her and then yeah that's all i'm getting for angelina that's what we're gonna do um i'm heading out right now to go to target which yesterday I went, y'all know I had I went out yesterday to get some um to get a moisturizer and I ended up getting this one. I think I showed y'all, which this is the one that I plan on getting anyway. This is the Bioma Moisturizing Gel Cream with um Triceramide Complex plus Niacinamide plus green tea. So yeah, I like it so far. I used it last night and this morning, and it's a nice little moisturizer. Uh it's about the same like amount of product in here as the Neutrogena one but the Neutrogena one is like more expensive than this one this one is $16 basically like after tax 16 and some change and the Neutrogena one is like $20 $22 something like that and it's the same amount of product so oh my gosh this piece of hair is stuck to my lipstick my lip gloss um but yeah so I probably will start like buying this one just because it's cheaper and I think I like it so, yeah, we'll see once I finish it. Then I'll really know, like, if I want to rebuy it. But, yeah, I think I like it so far. So, yeah. And this bump. Like, why is it here? And this, like, what is going on? Like, my skin is actually doing decent. I mean, I have, like, a few. I have, like, one little breakout right here. I have this one on my chin, this one right here, and then this little breakout here. But, like, overall, my skin is doing so much better. Oh, and I have a bump right here on my nose. If y'all can see, like, how red it is right there. And it hurts. But, 
yeah overall my skin is actually doing really well i don't know if y'all could tell the difference in my skin but i definitely can with you know like me changing up my products and stuff so yeah i'm actually like happy with my skin i'm pretty happy with it i think it looks good i think my dark spots are fading really well yeah i think my dark spots are fading pretty well all right y'all so i am back from target that's the only place that i went well i went to dollar tree as well um but i was in target for most of the time i didn't take my camera out the whole time as y'all can tell because y'all didn't see me at the store at all but yeah i mean i wasn't i was walking around doing much of nothing so from dollar tree i got this cute little bow hold up i think my screen is dirty it's definitely dirty I got this from Dollar Tree. This is for the bottle that I got for Angeline. Let me show y'all. I went to the liquor store yesterday and got her a bottle of Zellion. I got the bow to go on it because this is her gift. So I'm just gonna put the bow on it, which I might put the bow on the back so you can still see the, but you know what it is. It don't matter. I'm gonna put the bow right here. So that's her gift. I didn't get a bag like I told y'all earlier because I just think it's just going to be too heavy. Every time I bought in like a bottle and tried to put it in a gift bag, it just be too heavy. You end up having to like hold the bottom of the bag. So that's what I went to Dollar Tree for. This is the little cup that I got for a deer. Oh my gosh, what's happening? Okay. My tripod was like slowly like falling down. Is it still doing it? It is. Why is it doing that? Anyway, that's freaking weird. The little basket that I got. And I also got this from Dollar Tree. I was trying to get some wine glasses out of Target today, but they didn't have any. And now that I think about it, I've never seen wine glasses in Target. So yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna get some wine glasses from Anthropology. They have some really cute ones. But they're a little expensive, so I mean they're not that bad. It's like thirty-five dollars for four of them, which I mean a wine glass. Look, do y'all see how my camera is falling? Like y'all see this? That's so weird. It's never done this before. I also got this little um. A little bit of wine this is pinot grigio like i said i don't really know if she really drinks wine but i mean we're all gonna be there this weekend so it's four of them and there will be four of us at her house so i mean if she doesn't really like it then we can just have a little bit of wine just a little you know so i'll put this i'll put these in the basket oh i meant to also get like some little like stuff to put in the bottom of the basket i forgot that was what i was supposed to get out of dollar tree too I got her this, um, what is this? A diffuser, right? It's a little diffuser thing. I got this, this is from Target, this is $10. This is the Nectarine flavor, Island Star Fruit and Nectarine scent, not flavor. <laughs> Please don't eat it, scented reed diffuser. So I got this and I got a neutral color because this is something that she'll like have in her apartment, like setting out as like decor almost. So I didn't want to get this green because I don't know what her like, colors are like in her living room or her bedroom so yeah the rest of this stuff is just like a cup and then like the shaker it doesn't really matter what color that is but this i didn't want to go like too colored on it because i just don't know what her um theme is or like her colors are then also got her a 25 dollar gift card to target let me take this off what the heck oh i got a write on it so that she knows how much is in here. And it says, you go girl. So I just thought it was cute, you know, like congrats on your apartment, you go girl. So I got that. I was looking for one that was green to kind of match the vibes, but they didn't have one that was cute. They had some that had green in it, but it wasn't cute. But yeah, so this is her little housewarming basket from me. I was trying to make sure that it was filled up. Um, and yeah, it's pretty cool. Oh, that is so cute. I probably will have to like, fix it a little bit better but the basket was perfect perfect size real cute so this is her housewarming gift from me this feels like summer
eight. It's eight, fifteen, eight twenty-one actually, and I have already started work, but I'm just now getting up to like, you know, brush my teeth and wash my face and stuff. So that's what I'm about to do. Sometimes I do my mouthwash before I brush my teeth. Or maybe I should do my oil pulling first and then I can do my mouthwash after. Yeah, but sometimes I do my mouthwash before I brush my teeth. I don't know why. Just depending on the mood I'm in. But I showed y'all this oil pulling or this oil pull stuff um, that I got from Amazon the other day. Like I said, they do sell this at Walmart. I saw it in there the other day. So, yeah. Hey y'all, I'm about to do my nails. Um, I decided just to do some short white French tip because, yeah, I just feel like it's simple, it's cute, and that's what we're gonna do. So I'm still working, it's 3.05. So the only thing that I needed to do, I already have my clothes together. They're not really packed, they're just kind of thrown in the bag. But I already know like what I'm wearing and stuff. Or you know what I'm packing to wear. So I'm good with that. I don't have to do that. I'm still working, obviously. So bear with me for a second. Um and yeah, but I'm about to do my nails because I'm not gonna have time to do them. I don't wanna wait until I get off to do them because they be taking me like, you know, a little bit. Not too long, but yeah. I think these are the ones I wanna do. Just like some short French tips. Yeah, I guess. I guess. I don't got time to really be thinking too much about it. So yeah, we're just gonna do the short. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna do the French tips, the little white French tips. Good morning, y'all. Um, I'm trying to get me the showers on. We're at these place. I got here last night, um, but I didn't go on nothing because literally I want to sleep soon that I'm here. Um, the traffic is so bad. But yeah, I'm about to take a shower, um, and we have reservations for brunch at 1.30 at Station 24 um, in D.C. I'm pretty sure it's in D.C. So, yeah, I'm about to take my shower. They just uh, went to the, the hair store because Shadi needed some lashes. So, I figured I would start getting ready while they were gone. Um, it's 9.56. Like I said, our reservation is at 1.30. So, we got time. We got time. So yeah, I'm gonna take a shower and I'll take y'all along with me for brunch so y'all can see the food, feel the vibes. I feel like I've heard of Station 4 before, but I've never been. But the TikTok look, you know, the cute menu looks good. So yeah, but I'm gonna start getting ready and I'll see y'all later on today. recently did it like maybe like two weeks ago like doing it. good it worked it is i was like geez louise Let them find me, never trust a big butt in the smile of the Ronnie. I'm a rep queen, 
put me in my dog.